It has been a long time since I have uploaded a video here, but as you can tell from the title, big changes are on the horizon, so I figured I ought to give you guys an update and let you know what's going on. So for the past two years, David and I have been living in Arizona. We absolutely love it. It's so peaceful, it's so beautiful. We live on the largest cul-de-sac in the world. We live in one of the biggest cities in the country and yet it doesn't feel like it. I am a two minute walk from where I am right now in the beautiful Sonoran Desert. There's hiking trails everywhere. Living in this dry climate has done wonders for our health. That being said, we will be leaving at least temporarily. Our lease is coming to an end. The house we are living in is going on the market. And we knew that going in, we were told by the owner that one of two things may happen. They may sell the house, they may move back into it after a couple of years. In fact, I was secretly hoping at the time that we would have the opportunity to purchase it. And lo and behold, we did, but we declined. We feel like we want to be more mobile at this time to be able to visit family and friends back East when we want to and to be able to see so many of the beautiful, beautiful sights on this part of the country that we've never seen before. And we love to travel with our cats. They love to travel with us. And we've had great experiences with pet-friendly hotels traveling from here to New England, but there are some more remote locations that may not have as many options we actually did start physically looking at RVs about a year ago. We've been looking at them online for longer than that, but we started going to RV shows and RV dealers over the last year. And the first time we did this, it was a horrible experience. We were left so, so sad. We felt like our dreams were crushed because I had horrible reactions to the RVs just being in them for a few minutes. And what I mean is chemical sensitivities. Many of them are produced with um, materials that produce off-gassing that are toxic. And being in the RV for even just a few minutes left me feeling nauseous and dizzy and lightheaded and my sinuses were swelling up. And so I thought, well, what are we gonna do now? I did some more research and discovered there are a handful of RV companies that do produce rigs that are made with healthier materials. So we have yet to find one locally in person that we can at least tour to get a feel for it, but that is the next step. We are grateful that we have a business that allows us to work from anywhere in the country. And we are grateful for the support that we have received in the last few years. And we are going to continue to operate our business from the road and with this geographic freedom, give back in a completely different capacity. We're honing in on animal welfare and animal rescue. That is something that we are very passionate about. I have just adored living here. I am really, really sad to leave here, but I know that we are also ready for the next adventure. And I hope the people that end up buying the house that we're living in really appreciate what they have here. It's so quiet, it's so peaceful, it's so tranquil. And there's a swimming pool in the backyard that I am gonna miss. Swimming has been huge for me uh, as far as my health. Exercise has been a challenge for me. And this is coming from a person who would go to the gym every day and would feel off if I didn't go to the gym every day. And now I, I can't even tell you the last time I was in a gym. Yes, this place has been amazing for us, for our health. And we are super excited for the next step. I am also terrified. I hope to upload more videos more frequently on this channel. If you haven't subscribed yet and you want to receive updates, feel free to do that. I'm also going to post in the description of this video links to our businesses if you would like to support us. Thank you so much for watching and 